going on guys? We are at the Mobile Hunters Expo 2024 Northeastern Show. We are here with Mr. Doug. How are you doing, bro? With Rack and Stick. So, Mr. Doug, you are the inventor of the Rack and Stick, which is essentially a shooting stick. Correct. And that's not its only use. No, sir. So can you tell us about how one can utilize this in the field? You bet you. So as far as a rack and stick goes, this is a shooting stick setup right here. You have a bumper button on the bottom. Stands out. Spring loaded. Can use it with a crossbow or a rifle. Would you like me to show you how to use it? Absolutely. Let me, let me get out of your way. Let me pull my chair up here real quick. So this is like not like a conventional shooting stick where you'd sit it on the ground and dance around it. If you're in a tree stand or blind, you lay it right there on the front hit, front uh, sling mount, you grab the stick and the sling. You have full movement because the stick actually moves with you as a shooting rest. If you need to stand up, you can stand up, readjust, you're still solid as a rock. Because of the spring pressure, it actually takes recoil out of your rifle as well. It's also used as a field dressing tool. All these ends are interchangeable quarter 20 threads it's a spreader for field dressing your deer extend out compress locks in the hind quarters not the hind quarters but the hawks of the deer that way you have two hands to maneuver the deer around as you're field dressing once you're done field dressing all you got to do is give us a quarter turn you can lift the whole back end of the deer up at one time grab the front legs of the horns up on the four-wheeler in the truck on your wheelie cart. The rack and stick also has dragon ends. You put these in the rear hawks of the deer, the same place you cut the hang. Lock it in, put it behind your back, you can drag your deer out. I have straps. Screw these off, straps go here. You can put this around your waist, pull your deer out with this as well. You can even lash this to your backpack to pull it out. This is the newest product I have on the market right now. Just brought it to the show this week. This is a saddle stick by Rackin. Same concept, extends out, same spring pressure. The ends are different. They can be used as a hip pinch eliminator for larger frame fellows like myself. Also as a shooting stick. Shooting stick's the same concept. I use a crossbow this time. If you're sitting in the saddle, that goes right on your hip, compress the spring, push it into your shoulder. That way you can maneuver and shoot in the saddle however you need to. These ends are also interchangeable, so you can actually buy the powder coated use to put in these and actually field dress your deer with this tool as well. Just give you a little Backstory, this is my original rack and stick. I made this 13 years ago to skin and quarter elk so one man could do it. I'm still using this to this day. This stick right here, three years ago, I shot an elk at 330 yards with this. Stick right here as a shooting rest and then went and skinned and quartered the elk with the same stick. <laughs> Very nice. And so I see you've got one back here set up as a gamble. Yes, sir. So this setup right here is for guys who want to go out spike hunting, same spike camp out in the woods over the weekend. This is a gamble setup. All these pieces are interchangeable. This right here is actually a racking stick. All you do is you screw the eyelets in, D-ring comes out, loop comes out, put that in your pack. The cool thing about this setup here, it's not like your traditional gamble. I'm sure everybody's had the hind quarter fly on the ground while they're quartering their deer up. With this setup here, Weight gets lost off this side, weight's all on this side. Stays in place. All these pieces will be available, and some are available right now on rackandstick.com. And come see me on Facebook at Rack and Stick. Nice. Thanks for taking the time to get with us. Thank you very much.